Абсолютний чемпіон світу. Непереможний українець. 20 серпня. Олександр Усик проти Ентоні Джошуа. Бій за себе і за країну. So, uh, here we are with the unified, just fresh, defended titles. Heavyweight Alexander Usyk. Please greet him. Give him a round of applause. Alexander, congratulations. Can you just talk us through how that fight was different to September, please? Один з я віддав Ентоні. One judge scored it in favor of Anthony Joshua. That's the difference between the first fight and the second. Чим він ще відрізняється, що цей, цей поєдинок, який відбувався годину назад, this fight that was taking place just one hour ago. Він дуже важливий був для моєї країни. It was extremely important for my country. Для моєї команди. For my team. І особисто для мене. And personally for me. Тому що я боксував за всю країну. Because I did box for the whole country. Та за пол міра. And the half of the world. Він відрізнявся тим, що незважаючи на те, що я можу контролювати свої емоції, я трошечки, але переживав. It differed as well that uh, in spite of uh, my ability to control the emotions, I was worrying a bit. Особисто в дев'ятому раунді. Especially in the round number nine. Но це був елемент surprise. But that was a uh, surprising element. Uh... Ентоні в той час, коли був восьмий раунд, він подумав, що він вже виграв. Я це побачив в його глазах, може такого і не було, я не знаю. I'm not sure whether I'm right or not, but uh, I saw in round number eight, I saw in AJ's eyes that he was feeling victorious already. Але я повторював собі, ти не можеш зупинитися. Ти не можеш зупинитися. And I kept telling myself, you can not stop. You can't stop. You Ти... cannot stop. Доволі багато стояло на кону. Uh, some big things were at stake. І слава Богу, перемога є. Пояси їдуть в Україну. Україна переможе. And thanks God, uh, the belts are coming back to Ukraine. The victory is with us, and Ukraine won. Alexander, congratulations. Antoine Allen from ITV News. In terms of coming into this fight, people said that if AJ was able to use his size, that he'd be able to defeat you. Obviously, in round nine, he did use his size, but you remained on your feet, and you go home to Ukraine with the belt. So does that make today's victory a little bit sweeter because every strategy that they threw at you, you were able to still be victorious? <laughs> so the reason why belts are coming back to Ukraine is that Anthony Joshua didn't use his size advantage to the end. Не розміри важливі, коли ти боксуєш чи це справжня війна була в ринзі. Size doesn't matter when you are fighting. That was a real war, genuine war in the ring. І розміри тут ні до чого. And the size is not that uh, important. Я думаю, тут працює дух. This is where the real spirit works. Sasha, colleagues. Uh, I hold the flag signed by uh, our soldiers, our fighters, who, who was at uh, Severodonetsk, Lysychansk. They signed warmest wishes to you and uh, wishes to the victory. You on the ring and ours at the battlefield. Thank you so much. Glory to Ukraine. Uh, and everything gonna be Ukraine. It's from Battalion 205.
козацькому роду нема переводу. Слава Україні! Героям слава! Alexander, uh, congratulations on a hard-fought victory tonight, uh, Radio Rahim. Uh, Joshua had uh, quite a bit to say to you and to the crowd in the ring after the fight. How did that make you feel, and what do you say in response to what Joshua had to say after the fight in the ring? Да нічого не відчував. Він емоції. Все нормально, я з ним треба поспілкуватися. I didn't feel much at that time uh, when he was a bit frustrated. Uh, just common emotions. Uh, it's all good. Uh, we need to just communicate a little bit. Я не хочу бути гордим. I don't want to be proud. Я хочу бути смиренним, я над цим працюю. Гординя вбиває. Хто себе превищує, того Господь знизить, а хто себе знижає, того Господь вверх. The one who brings himself up, the Lord will calm down. The one who stays down, the Lord will bring him up. Що ти думаєш про Джошу як про чоловіка? Ні, у мене до нього повага. Ну, я поважаю цю людину, але він трошки сьогодні на емоціях. Я так трошки бачив, що він там кидався на когось з моєї команди. Якщо він хоче Ну, якщо він хотів ще на кулаках побитися, то я йому це 100% не советую робити. Тому що у мене половина команди це стрітфайтери. I feel nothing but respect to Anthony Joshua. I I saw him a bit emotional and I saw him like uh, bullying some of my uh, teammates and that would look like a bare knuckle fight, but that's uh, I don't recommend him to do because uh, most of them are horrible street fighters. От я маю там 20 поєдинків на даний момент. У мене деякі хлопці мають 25 поєдинків, але на вулиці. 25 боїв, 25 нокаутів, вони всі 25 виграли. I have 20 bouts, 20 wins at the moment. Some of my guys have 25 and 25 wins by the way of knockout. Since everyone thought AJ is going to win and he himself believed that. Do you think that he was very desperate to win would be a disadvantage value for his defeat? I'm sorry, but not everyone was thinking Joshua gonna win. Like most of them, not all I would say probably 50-50, maybe even 60-40 to Alexander. The Lord himself, uh, the team that is with me and my trainings, that what helped me to get the victory. Um, Tyson Fury is posted on Instagram saying that that fight was where Alex just said it there, shite. Um, and he beat you guys both in one night. What's your response back to that? That's what he's dreaming every day. He's gonna beat his ass. Alexander, after the first victory you had against AJ in Tottenham, I asked you what you wanted to do next. And you spoke about spending time with your family and taking your children to school. Obviously, Ukraine has changed. So what is your wish for your future? What you'd love to happen to Ukraine going forward and yourself? My future, my country, we will win. The future of my country is we're gonna win. І будемо економічно на дуже високому рівні. The economy will grow considerably. До нас буде приїжджати багато туристів, туристів, тому що наша країна дуже багата історією. The tourists all around the world gonna travel to Ukraine because Ukraine is very rich with history. Багато людей в світі вже бачать. Колись вони знали Україну за які спортсменам Клічко, Шевченко, Усик, Ломаченко. 
Many people in the world knew Ukraine because of the athletes like Klitschko brothers, like uh, Andriy Shevchenko, Lomachenko, Lomachenko. Usyk. Usyk. Yes. Зараз нашу країну весь світ знає як ту, яка захищає свою країну від другої армії світу. Now the whole world knows Ukraine as the country that is defending itself from the second army, second biggest army in the world. І ми дуже гарно стоїмо, ще й накидаємо їм. And we stand strong and we give them a lot back. Я просто хочу сказати, що деякі люди в світі вони недооцінюють когось. Відчиніть, відчиніть очі, що відбувається в світі. Просто відчиніть і подивіться, що відбувається в світі зараз на території України. I want to say that some people in the world are underestimating what's going on. I want to appeal to everyone, open your eyes and see clearly what is really going on in Ukraine. Right, українці, українці, вони не здаються, вони до кінця. Вони будуть йти до кінця, і вони переможуть. Ми переможемо. Це просто треба трошки часу на це і все. Ukrainians never give up. They always go to the end. They always win. We're gonna definitely win. We just need a little more time. Yeah. Two more questions. Two more questions. Two more questions. Alexander, congratulations on another phenomenal performance and more proof that Ukrainians never give up. It was quite remarkable. I think with my old ears, I heard you say that the only fight you would now take would be Tyson Fury for the undisputed championship. Is that correct that you might not even fight again if you don't get that fight? Так, я так сказав. Yes, that's true. That's what I said in the ring. Okay, we've got one more last question. Uh, uh, Alexander, um, Vladimir Putin likes to talk about being a black belt in judo and riding his horse topless, but you're now the baddest man on the planet. Is that a pretty cool thing and is that great for your for your compatriots and your soldiers to see? Добре надихати людей. він він це все робить. він показує, що він що він сильний і що він мощний, що він красивий. насправді він не такий. Це все обман. Він показує, що він сильний, але він слабкий. Він показує, який він, але він дуже слабкий. Uh, everything he shows is, ju is just to show that he's strong, but he's not. Otherwise, he wouldn't do that. Wouldn't, wouldn't show how, how strong, how big he is. Uh, in reality, he's uh, very weak. And with that, we conclude the press conference. Thank you very much, everyone, for attending. Congratulations, Alexander Usyk. And the steel. Додому, хлопці, до хати. Усім доброго вечора з України.